Digital innovation is taking traditional stocks onto the blockchain. That is the same technology that powers cryptocurrencies. Tokenized securities are emerging as a new way for investors to view trading in company shares. Even though a low, a low early adoption rates and uncertainty over regulations could make this a risky investment. CNA's Ronald Lim explains. Tokenized stocks are securities represented as digital tokens on a blockchain. They are held in a digital wallet, much as crypto coins are. Each token mirrors the price of a real share. In principle, they can be digitally traded directly between investors without a traditional exchange. Imagine buying stocks, or at least some exposure to a stock, directly from your crypto wallet. Today, trades take about two days to settle, but with tokenization, settlement could happen in theory instantly, enabling 24-7 trading beyond stock market hours. Tokenization also enables fractional ownership, letting investors buy tokens that represent small portions of company shares for a fraction of the price of the real-world stock. It could lower barriers, boost diversification, and give emerging market investors easier access to global stocks without the need for foreign brokerage accounts. Platforms like Robinhood and Solana are already offering tokenized US stocks in Europe. Other crypto exchanges, Coinbase, Gemini, Kraken are also exploring tokenization. Major banks are experimenting with tokenizing bonds and funds. Now for them, faster settlement means less capital locked up in processing, freeing up funds for other business users. But as the crypto industry hypes this as a leap forward, traditional financial firms and regulatory experts are raising alarm bells, saying it poses risks to investors and market stability. You do not have uh, voting rights as a, a holder of the tokenized asset, um, and the uh, underlying security is just is simply mirrored. So you have price exposure without actual ownership and redemption rights. Regulators in Singapore, Hong Kong and Europe are already working to clarify rules around this. Still, it's early days. But as frameworks mature, tokenized assets could help bridge traditional finance and the blockchain economy. For everyday investors, it could mean lower costs of trading and convenience, but also new risks to navigate. For CNA Explains, I'm Roland Lim.